Agora TV. The world is thinking. There are many interesting quotes. If you, if you Google on things like mathematics and elegance and aesthetics, you get all sorts of them. One of the most oft repeated is this one from Bertrand Russell. Mathematics, rightly viewed, possesses not only truth but supreme beauty. The language itself is beautiful, right? A beauty cold and austere like that of sculpture, without appeal to any part of our weakened nature, without the gorgeous trappings of paintings or music, yet sublimely pure and capable of a stained perfection, such as only the greatest art can show. Okay, you know, a statement which definitely needs a black background and a red title, if ever I saw one. <laughs> you know, believe me, if the lights were down, this is cool. <laughs> Uh, I mean, I, I, it's actually on my laptop screen. It's even better on the screen. Okay. Uh, here's another nice one. Um, that, by the way, is, is, is written. It's dedicated, this is from something that was dedicated to Don Knuth, the profession of computer science here. Um, famous mathematician called Oswald Veblen. Mathematics is one of the essential emanations of the human spirit, a thing to be valued in and for itself, like art or poetry. Another couple that I like. Pure mathematics is the poetry of logical ideas. Isn't that cool? Einstein. Yeah. And then J.J. Sylvester, British mathematician, uh, some time ago. Uh, mathematics is the music of reason. Um, isn't that cool? I mean, a, this is aesthetic. I mean, people are humming and agreeing and nodding. Yeah, we get it. We get it. This is beautiful stuff. Okay, so now, having established the case for the aesthetic part in mathematics, because that really does tie me back to Alex's point about the, the being more like art. Yes, I'm going to concede that when you look at the aesthetics, yeah, it's, it's really like, it looks much more like art than it does like science, because the aesthetics play a huge role. But let's just do a calculation. We've got a matrix, we can count things. Where do these columns agree? Well, they both have a definition in the case of mathematics and science. Art doesn't have a definition. So right now it's 1-0 for mathematics being more like science. Well, the next one, that's a home goal for the artists because it doesn't apply. So we've got a comparison here. So there's the, the similarity on row 2 is between science and mathematics. So now it's 2-0 in favour of mathematics being more like science. This is a draw. Okay, so that's... There's only one round left in this one, and there we have to concede that mathematics is much more like the artistic community. Count them up, folks. We now have a decision, and if we've got a decision, we should check it with the world's greatest authority on decisions, which is Judge Judy, who says... <laughs> By a score of two to one with a draw, I find that mathematics is more science than that. I rest my case. 